Okay, so here's our second one. So we'll just do two of these problems. Yep. Um, and this has to do with a bike helmet, a bell, and a lock. Hmm. We just had to deal with that for your school, right? Yeah. Cool. So it says these signs tell about some items for sale. The same items have the same prices. What do you think that means? Same items. That means, well, the bell and the helmet could cost $39 together. Um, yeah, that's what that means, that the bell and helmet here cost $39. But I, when, it, when they say the same items have the same price, they mean the helmet here costs the same as oh. the helmet here. And the lock here costs the same as what? Hmm. Well, it costs, it's the same as that lock. Yeah, and different items have different prices. So the lock and the helmet don't have the same price. Yeah. How much is the helmet? How much is the bell? How much is the um, the bike? Helmet? What? The lock, lock, probably. Hmm. And then there's this quote from Albert Einstein down here. Don't worry about your problems with mathematics. I can assure you mine are far greater. Hmm. Hmm. Well, how are we going to figure out this problem? Well, we could reassign the values to the snap cubes. Oh, you want to do a snap cubes again? Well, let's try, well, we can try doing it with algebra. We, well, we can, we can call value, we can set values for the helmet, we can call the helmet X, the bell Y, and the lock Z. Okay. So, then we, we can say the helmet, well, X, we can say x plus y is 39. All right, so what's x? x is the helmet. Okay, so tell you what, why don't you write, write what x, y, and z are and we'll move to the whiteboard, okay? Okay. 